Tapos baka forward niya yun. Time lapse ba? Hindi. Busog ka agad dito. Ano? Harap mo naman sa'yo yung camera. Saan na kaharap sa akin? This is day one of test printing our invitation. So this is the cover page. I made it myself. And then we did a lot of test printing to see the quality, which one is better. We also tried cutting it to see if it's cuter. The rest of the materials for the invitation haven't arrived yet, so we'll wait for that one. It's easier to
first time in Coffee Bean. Katan? Stay. No. Stay. Okay, go. Good girl. Another lazy afternoon. The clouds covered in gray. Third coffee of the day. Almost fell asleep on soon. I yawn at the display. Third meeting of the day. But I can hear raindrops step dancing on the roof. It's like they're calling out. Don't lose your youth. I can stay inside and tap away inside. Oh. got back from the designer and went to for my gown and wala lang na akong other agenda actually for today but I needed to think kaya hindi mo na ako umuwi agad I was actually planning to stay outside pa but I still have coffee from Starbucks and I bumili ulit ng another coffee just to stay at a cafe so I decided to uh, uh, Oh god, sorry. Sobrang stressful pala talaga mag-isip ng gown. I mean, it, it's a given, but you know, when you're already there and dahil pa palang so many factors you need to consider, so many options, like sa skirt, dahil palang mga options ganyan. I'm really, wala talaga akong alam. Parang, 
I only searched sa Pinterest and then nagpakita ko ng pegs and I thought that was it. But of course, hindi. Because medyo indecisive din ako on my part. Parang meron akong specific detail I like in one gown and then another detail in another gown. But when you try to combine it, hindi pala siya bagay. So, buti na lang. The designer that I talked to, she kind of knew my, my vibe. Um, I believe she's just two years older than me, if I'm not mistaken, kasi ID 111 siya sa Sal, so I, I assume na two years older siya sa akin, because I'm ID 113. Anyway, ayun, um, I needed to do some thinking because I don't know if I want to splurge. Of course, it's every girl's dream to have the best gown and, you know, splurge on it. But then, kasi I'm also considering practicality. Kasi, you know, as you get older, you realize na hindi pwedeng sa gown lang magagastos. Of course, there are other things. So, wedding. Our budget is not tight at all. Pero yun nga, parang I want to set a specific budget for the gown. And then, allocate the others sa ibang bagay. But then, um, nung kinoto kanina, my um, preferred kind of gown, yung style and the details itself, was over the budget I set. Although, sa ibang bagay naman, merong excess sa budget, I'm not sure if I want to allocate it there. So, medyo torn ako, kaya I really need some thinking. And I'm also waiting for Kevin to wake up, kasi he's currently in Canada, so medyo salungat yung um, time zone namin. It's really nice here. I, I don't know if I'm allowed to stay here sa area na to, but I'm not gonna stay late, so I need to stop talking na and do the things I need to do. But I don't want to get in trouble, so I really need to finish what I need to do now and to think the thoughts I need to think out. I guess I kind of underestimated myself and my ability to think. So, up on 15 minutes, I figure out what I need to So, now I'm going back to the car, which is just right there, by the way. But I really want to enjoy the outdoors. I haven't been like out so walang agenda masyado in a while so I might stay inside the car and just roll down the windows and appreciate it yeah for today's wedding errand pala I was just alone and it felt nice because I felt more in control of things so hindi mo na ko pinipigil ng mga kasama ko but I felt the weight of my role in this wedding of course I'm the bride and it was refreshing for me because yun nga, hindi pa ulit ako nakakalabas by myself and we all need our alone time or me time every once in a while and I think I'm also you know using this opportunity to appreciate my own um, company because in a few months I will have a constant buddy in life partner in life it's really nice to, you know, just breathe fresh air, pause for a while, reflect on things. I think this wedding is making me more sentimental than I already am. And it's really exciting. I'm not gonna lie, I am getting nervous about many things. But more than that, I am also excited and looking forward, forward to it. Not just because of the preparation, the kaarte hands and all, but, you know, the event itself. I really wish daddy was still around. And it makes me wonder, what, what is he thinking up there? Like, I'm, I'm, I'm sure no man he's happy for me, but, you know, it's nice to hear something from him. No matter how impossible that sounds. But yeah. 
I really miss him. And I'm gonna miss him more on the wedding day itself, of course. I mean, who imagined the bug going up? Who imagined that they won't have their dad to walk them down the aisle? But yeah. And then, talaga, you know, sorry for my mannerism. Hi. This is really it.